hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video as you see by the title it's gonna be the video where i show you all our closest uh friends and family's reactions they were so fucking cute is somebody here anyways this is the video where i show you guys <laughs> The reaction of um, our families and our closest friends. Nobody saw it coming. There you go. Nobody saw it coming. Um, I guess some people did because obviously because we're in a relationship or whatever. But because I was always determined. I was like, I'm not going to have kids right now. Like, I still want to travel. I still want to do this and that. Like, I don't want no kids. So my family was like, oh, you know, well, she's not going to have kids right now. And then, boom. I've had these videos for a while now and I'm just now posting them because we didn't tell everybody at the same time like we literally told people in my first month other people in my third month other people when I was like literally like three four weeks ago you know and it's also nice to keep them as memories that's why I'm also uploading them on YouTube because bitch Imagine if I kept all these videos in my phone that's a lot of stories so that's where YouTube comes in handy but I wanted to make this video so I can explain to y'all how we told that person, why we told them the way we did, where we told them, and you know, why we waited or whatnot. So y'all can understand the situation because every person that we told, we literally told them in a different way, in a different situation. When I found out that I was pregnant, I didn't want to tell Chris right away, right? Because I wanted the ultrasound, as my last video said. So the first person that I told was my best friend, Maybelline because i wanted to tell somebody and why not tell your best friend right so i told her that exact same day and i had told chris i was like you know i'm gonna go help her out with this project that we're doing blah 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 you know but i really went to go tell her that i was pregnant and i didn't know how the fuck to tell her either but i was like it's christmas you know I always give her a spooky basket like why not make her a spooky basket <sighs> so one, I was in a hurry. Two, it was late as fuck. Like, I just wanted to get this over with. So I was like, let me make this ghetto-ass spooky basket. Like, it was so ugly. Like, if you know me, I'm so fucking detailed with my shit. So when I saw this, I was like, this is spooky basket. Like, this shit motherfucking ugly. But Maybelline's so humble that she was just like, I'm getting something. So I don't give a fuck. I like. <laughs> but it was so ugly. It was literally not decorating. I was just trying to get it done with, you know? So I made her a spooky basket filled with candy and then the other um, part of the spooky basket was the pregnancy test. And then on the box, um, as you see in the picture, it says only the best friend gets. And then when she would open it, she would see promoted to auntie and then she would have my pregnancy test there. So this is gonna, this, this is um, her reaction. Okay, okay. You went all out, you went all out. It's not as decorated as, you know, but... My favorite. You know it. <laughs> and I'm dying for that. Right? Yeah, we can share. Yeah, we can share. You have to share? share? Yeah. <laughs> Sharing is caring. Oh! Oh, my favorite one of them! Oh, oh. oh! This is your favorite. <laughs> I knew oh, I had to get those. It was like a oh, big butterfinger. That's cool. That's cool. Mm -hmm. that's, cool. Yeah, that's, oh. cool. that's cool. That's cool. Um, that's just gonna make a mess. Let's let's not, please. Okay. We have the same button though. Yeah. Well, now we have two. Okay. And now this. Mhm. Mm How would you see that? Only the best friend. <laughs> Leslie, you're oh. kidding. <laughs> no. Oh my God. Read the read the bag. Do you know what this means? Dude, I had to tell somebody so I couldn't wait. Oh my god! I'm not ready! Stop! Oh, look, it's just nothing. Look. 
Like, like you just nothing. Oh my god! No, it's so stuck! Look, you just nothing. Oh, it's just nothing, puppy. It's just everything. Oh my god, you fucking. I'm fucking <laughs> ruined! I was like, why is she acting so weird? It was so cute and it was so recent that we both literally busted out in tears. Like, I couldn't hold it anymore. I was just like, I can't believe, like, I finally told somebody, like, when you're pregnant and you tell somebody that first person, that's a whole fucking relief. Like, damn, like, I finally told somebody, you know what I mean? The ones that get it, get it, and the ones that don't, don't. We decided to tell my mom, and again, I didn't know how the fuck to tell her. So I remember this was a Friday, and it was after one of my appointments, and we had a uh, ultrasound. So we got that ultrasound. We put it in a shoebox with um, her grandma cookie, some shoes, and a pacifier, and, you know, the ultrasound river. And I was like, how can I tell my mom? Like, um, she's going to be like, what the fuck is this box for? You know, some bullshit like that. So on the way to her house, I called her. I was like, hey, you know, I want to buy my grandma some shoes um, because she's diabetes. So I want to get her some diabetes shoes, you know. So tell me what size she is again and, like, what kind of shoes should I get her? You know, I was just trying to get her, like, you know. So, um she fucking fell for it she fell for it completely and when i got to the house um i was so fucking nervous <laughs> it literally took me like 10 minutes to bring out the box and tell her but i went to my car well i went to the house you know acted like normal whatever and then i went to the car got the box and i was like look at the shoes i got my grandma and in the video you're gonna see that she was cooking so she was like, open it. And then I was like, no, you open it. And I was like, she was like, no, I'm cooking. And I was like, open it, you know? But after I said open it twice, I got my phone and I started recording her. Yeah, let's just go. Come back, my grandma. Okay, open it. You open it. Aida. What do you think? Ya te estaba puro diciendo. Creo te lo hice que lo hiciera abuela. A couple weeks later, um, we had to do our pregnancy announcement shoot. So I was like, how are we going to get the photography if we want if we haven't told nobody that we're pregnant, you know? So we decided to tell his friend OG and Chepo at the same time because they go to the gym together. So I was like, well, why don't we tell them there? I was like, we can tell Chepo that we're pregnant and then ask him if he can take us these pictures. And then we're all just going to be there so we can go ahead and tell OG as well. So that's why um, we told them both together in the car. Why in the car? Because I met them at the gym and we were supposed to talk about pictures that we wanted, like a couple. I guess he was thinking couple's picture. And then, um, yeah, this is the reaction. <laughs> So my boy, 
Alright, so look. You ready? Mm -hmm. So we kind of have an idea, you know, like a little sign. So I want to tell you. Um, we're about to do some cover, some pictures, right? And, um, you know, I'm going to show my idea. But I'm going like, to tell you something else. You want like an estimate of how much you would charge for something like this? Yeah, what in studio? But like that. Mm, for it to come that nice, I don't have a studio that would be that nice, but we can rent a studio. Not like like in your like. Oh, like, you want to do yeah, it yeah. at, at Manny's? We no. can. Well, we saw, somewhere, yeah. But we like, can, we could, yeah, here. we could try something like that, but mm, <laughs> to make it look like that. <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? I didn't even get <laughs> it. I didn't even I'm really like, wait, I'm like, I'm like, yo, I didn't even real, I, I ain't even, damn, <laughs> I ain't even realize that when I said I was, that. I was just went out like, I wasn't even thinking about that shit. I wasn't even thinking about that shit. They planning ahead of time or something? Yeah. No, I didn't even think about it. I just had, I saw baby, so I was like, man, I just want a couple of photo shoots. That's and literally. That was, that's, I didn't even, <laughs> <damn>. <laughs> What just the like fuck? Nine weeks? You <laughs> motherfucker, that's why she wasn't smoking. I just, I just, I just I'm like, let's go vlog that shit. Like, guess what I, guess what I found? We are. Right now? <laughs> gotcha, little goofy. <laughs> A couple months later, I think it was like two or three months in my pregnancy, um, we told Christian. He invited us to his baby girl Chele's uh, birthday party. And you know, well, I wanted to go, but like I said, I was already showing, so I was like, fuck, like I need a time. So we got there, and I guess he didn't notice because it was cold already, so I had a jacket on and you couldn't tell. So I was like, buddy, you know, come with me to the car. I gotta show you something. It sucks that Chris didn't get the reaction right in the beginning, but he got it towards the middle. But anyways, okay, so I went to the car and he had no idea because like, what do you have like what do you have a gun or do you have some bricks or what we got to the car opened the car and i was acting like i was looking for something and i was pulling up the picture on my phone and i turned around and i showed him the ultrasound and he got so shook but i hate that we didn't get that on camera yeah when um when chris started recording yeah his reaction how his like first reaction had already passed and then this is where he was um congratulating us or whatever <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, so I'm down. That's good though. I, I'm happy for you. I really am. It's, I'm happy. It's gonna be. It's, it's, it's gonna hold a different chapter in your life for now. Yeah, You're gonna feel sad. like. Like some love that you never felt before. I'm gonna keep it hot with you. Okay. You know, when you love somebody, you never love somebody until you have a kid. I'm gonna keep it hot with you. I mean, you may love somebody like that, but it's like otro amor. You know? And then, um, Glow's birthday came up. So I was like, what better present to give her than to let her know she's gonna be a tia, you know? I was like, well, let's go out to eat. And then I'm gonna take a present. The present's gonna be, you know, her tia cookie and, um, and an ultrasound picture wrapped up, you know, in a gift bag. Also, shout out to um, Ivy Delights. She made all my cookies. Anyways, so we took her out to eat, and this was her reaction. <laughs> Open it really carefully. I set, set it on the table and everything. Okay. Yeah. Am I in the other way? Hold on, hold on, hold on. The other way? The other way? The other way? Yeah. No, it's that way, but just turn it. Yeah. Oh. Should be. No, like this way. Oh. <laughs> <gasps> no. Uh After we came back from from Glow's dinner, I was like, you know, might as well just tell your mom already because I can't hide it no more. You know, let's just go ahead and tell your family. So we were like, what way do we tell them without them noticing? You know, because 
they're smart. Like, luego, luego, when I, you know, get the deal or whatever. So, right before I was pregnant, me and Chris would always go to Cookie Crumble. Like, every week, we would get those new cookies that they bring out every week. And we would bring them. And, you know, we would all have cookies here at the house. So, I was like, why don't we get a Cookie Crumble box and then put their cookies in there with the ultrasound in the middle? So, we thought that was a great idea because, obviously, you weren't, we were not never going to, um, think what it was you know so i was like let's just say that we decorated some cookies at cookie crumble because they had a special to decorate your own cookie or whatever and then let's get them all together so they can see our so they can see our decorated cookies so that's what we did and this is their reaction it was so cute but i hate that i store that chris i think chris had a camera at this time he stopped recording like a little bit before um their friends left like we couldn't wait anymore we had to tell them when their friends were there so we stopped the camera early and then it was so cute the camera i wasn't recording anymore but when they had left i guess they didn't want to show their true emotions or whatever i don't know um when they had left she turned around and she started jumping up and down and smiling and just looking at Chris like oh my god like all, like all excited and everything and i wish i could have caught it on camera but i didn't because i turned it off because i thought that was you know that was their reaction but i guess they didn't want to show the actual reaction because their friends were there. They're gonna open it. Oh, okay. okay. So, aquí asómate. Y da tu mejor perfil. No, yo no. Eh, eh, como la mujer. No, dije, no, dije mujer, así las de todas las mujeres. Ahí está, ¿verdad? No, no. <laughs> ¿En serio? Oh, muchas felicidades. Bueno, negro. ¿Qué les dije? Doble. Felicidades, señor. Dios lo bendiga mucho y cuidado porque. Negro. Oh, ahora sí ya saben lo que va a ser eso, ¿eh? Ahora sí es una responsabilidad muy grande. Se acabaron las tocadas. Con razón no, no se iba, iba a tocar. tocar. Sí iba a tocar, pero la falta. <laughs> ¿Está? ¿Tú qué? ¡No chiquen! ¿Van a estar al mismo tiempo? No, Mario. Los veo en el año. No, los veo en el año. Algo. Algo. Si es niño, es niño. ¿Eh? ¿Vas a abrir? ¿Salud? Y sal. Salud. Y que no sea el único. So after um, we told our family and everything, we decided to tell the rest of Chris's friends. So obviously we had to tell the group. So he went to go and say, and then I think like the whole, like, did you get invited to this or or he sent him some, a screenshot, I think, or something, I don't know. But he sent it to his phone, and he was looking at it, and they thought he was playing. And then right there was uh, Brian, so he told Brian, and then Tony came down. So he told Tony, so them three found out at the same time. You can't be like, Landers, that's not even anywhere close to you. You can't be like, what? What is it? Look, 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 look. On God, I'm Kevin. On God, I'm Kevin. Let me see the messages with you. On God, I'm Kevin. Show me Leslie Tanks. On God, I'm Kevin. Show me Leslie Tanks. On God, I'm Kevin. I want to be recording you if I'm Kevin. Because you're Kevin. You see what you're Kevin. How am I Kevin? He's Kevin. Why would I be recording all the games if I'm Kevin? I'm like, he's Kevin. What? You're stupid, man. No, boy. Many 
Hey, it was gonna be one of us, and I'm glad it wasn't me. <laughs> Jeez, Jeez, crazy. Crazy. That's crazy, bro. Stop, nigga. <laughs> I think Manny was a kid, too. I'm gonna come out, and you gotta be like, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, he's not kidding. Joking, <laughs> right? God, crazy, man. What, Tony, come here. Oh, Tony, I'll oh, show Tony, show Tony right now. Hey, we don't got an option. We gotta make it out, man. Come here. What? Like we don't got an option. Like we don't make it out. Like, we might as well fucking go to Prince. Go to Chris. Show this nigga. Nah, show him on your phone. Show him on your phone. No, 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 no. Look, I saw something earlier when I when, when Eric came and like, bro, you gotta get out of here. I saw something big and like that. Show him, nigga. Where's it at? You saw it? No. Bro, that shit. That shit is fucking big. I'm telling you, there we got to make it out of the mud. Yes, not me, you stupid fuck. Oh my gosh. You thought it was you? <laughs> you better be a daddy. Hey, you better Stop. be a daddy. <laughs> the next one was Ariel. So, Ariel, um, he came to Chris's house because they had a gig, and from the key, se iban a ir juntos to the gig so eric came to his house or not tacos or whatever and chris was like hey yo did you get invited to this and he went like this and on chris's phone was our invitation for the ginger reveal little bro i got invited to this shit were you invited to it can i no baby <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> no way, y'all not fucking with me, bro. Yeah, oh god. Nigga, <laughs> what the fuck? Are you serious? Oh god. Nigga, that's that's a big ass dab up, bro. Oh, <laughs> boy, nigga. Hell yeah, bro. Fuck and he went to the ensayo of Los Primos del Este. So he saw Gio there. He told Gio outside, I think. So he was like, yo, so did you get invited to this? And he showed him his phone with their invitation and he read it. And then he told Eric inside when they were practicing. I think they were playing games or smoking. I don't know what the fuck they were doing. And then I think he said the same thing to Eric. And then you can just see where he showed him his phone. So look, I gotta show you something. Cause <laughs> I got invited to this, bro. I don't know if you got invited. That's what I said. That's you? You ain't that your last name? Leslie ain't. Oh, shit. That's a baby, my boy. <laughs> oh, you better have a baby? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good girl, man. Solo <laughs> focus, Then I wanted to tell my friends Rick and Kevin, but I rarely see them anymore since I, th since I stopped going out. I don't see them anymore. And so I was going to say, you know, well, let's invite them out to or something. But I didn't want to do that because that's so, that's very sus. Like, van a decir, buena esta nunca me invita a comer. Like, why is she doing this? Like, you know, something's up because they're not dumb. So I was like, let me just FaceTime them. And instead of me answering, it's like when they answer, the first thing they're going to see is the baby's ultrasound. So I did that with Rick and Kevin. What was the name? Ain't no way. <laughs> you for real? Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, I swear to God. We don't know yet. We're gonna find out um in two weeks. Um, three months already. Yeah. I'm big. 
Why? Appreciate it, bro. Yeah, buddy, we're already five months in. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. What, what made you, you want to have a kid now? I've been wanting a kid. What you mean? Since when? Every time we said something about kids, you said fuck them kids. Because I wasn't in a relationship. <laughs> Now, for my family, it was a little hard just because I couldn't get them all together. Like, I'm never telling my cousin, like, Edgar and Adrian, like, hey, let's meet up, or hey, let's go out to eat, or hey, let me go visit you or nothing, right? So if I did say that, like, it was going to see very, seem very sus, so I was stressing on how to tell them. Also, my deal, my brother, the same thing. So I was like, how do I do it? Like, what the fuck do I do? I was like, I miss Thanksgiving because I wasn't there on Thanksgiving. I was like, I can't wait till Christmas. What the fuck do I do? My uncle made glow and I come in for his birthday. So we went and then I was like, well, we can just take everybody's cookie and then quickly hand them out. So when they see it, they're going to be like, what the fuck? And then we can just tell everybody there. And it's just going to be family. So that was going to be great. And they were all going to be together. So I was like, let's just, you know, go ahead and tell them there. Just out of the random, I got up and I was like, hey, we got y'all something. And that's when we started handing out the cookies. Look, we got the cookies. Uh -huh. We did our pregnancy announcement a little bit before Christmas, so now everybody knows I'm pregnant. <clears throat> Only five months. This is my belly update. Ooh, I look huge. God damn. And honestly, I feel big for being five months. I feel like it's pura agua. Also, we're taking bets. We think it's gonna be boy or girl. Our first kid, whatever God wants to give us, is gonna be a blessing as long as it's a healthy baby. We're gonna love it. Like, you cannot imagine. <laughs> it's gonna be spoiled to the max. Um, but yeah, this is my belly. Five months. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I can't stop rewatching it. I really can't. Every time I watch it, I tear up. <sighs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you on my next video, which hopefully will be the ginger reveal. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. <laughs>